A vacation turns tragic. Tourist vanishes into Kuala Lumpur sinkhole. A bustling city street became the scene of a terrifying incident as a sinkhole opened up, swallowing a tourist hole. Vijaya Lakshmi Gali, a 48-year-old woman from India, was walking with her husband and friends when the ground gave way beneath her. Witnesses watched in horror as Gali disappeared into the chasm. The sinkhole, estimated to be at least 26 feet deep, sent shockwaves through the community. Authorities have launched an investigation to determine the cause of the sinkhole. The thoughts and prayers of people around the world are with Gali's family during this difficult time. Race against time rescue efforts commence as hope dwindles. As news of the sinkhole spread, a frantic rescue operation got underway. Over 100 rescuers, including firefighters, police officers, and emergency medical personnel rushed to the scene. They were met with a chaotic scene as onlookers gathered, desperate for any news of the missing woman. Time was of the essence, and rescuers knew that every second counted. Divers were deployed into the sinkhole, hoping to find Galley alive. They faced treacherous conditions, with limited visibility and the constant threat of further collapse. The air was thick with the smell of sewage, and the water was contaminated with debris. Despite the dangers, the rescuers pressed on, determined to bring Galley home. However, as hours turned into days, hope began to dwindle. The only sign of Galley that rescuers were able to recover was a single slipper, found floating in the murky water. The discovery heightened fears that she may have been swept away by the currents or buried beneath the debris. The families of Galley waited anxiously for news, their hopes fading with each passing moment. Deadly Depths Divers encounter treacherous obstacles in sinkhole. The challenges facing the rescue teams were immense. The sinkhole, formed from a collapsed sewer line, was filled with a toxic cocktail of sewage, debris, and mud. Divers described the conditions as some of the most dangerous they had ever encountered. The water was pitch black, making it impossible to see more than a few inches ahead. The debris field was extensive, consisting of everything from broken concrete and twisted metal to household garbage and human waste. The divers had to navigate this treacherous obstacle course while battling strong currents and the ever-present risk of further collapse. The conditions were so perilous that several divers had to be pulled from the sinkhole after experiencing equipment failures or becoming disoriented in the murky depths. Adding to the difficulty, the rescue teams were working against the clock. Every hour that passed decreased the likelihood of finding Galley alive. The longer she remained trapped in the sinkhole, the greater the risk of hypothermia, dehydration, or suffocation. Despite the daunting odds, the rescue teams continued to work tirelessly, driven by a glimmer of hope and a deep sense of duty. Agony of uncertainty. Search called off, leaving family in limbo. After days of relentless searching, the decision was made to call off the rescue operation. The Malaysian authorities cited perilous conditions and the lack of any sign of Galley. The news was met with heartbreak from Galley's family. With the search suspended, Galley's fate remains a mystery. Section 5. Outpouring of support, Malaysia rallies around grieving family. As news of the tragedy spread, an outpouring of support for Gali's family came from both within Malaysia and around the world. Strangers, touched by the family's plight, reached out with messages of condolence and offers of assistance. Local businesses donated food, clothing, and other necessities, while volunteers helped to distribute the donations and provide emotional support. The Malaysian government also faced pressure to address the issue of infrastructure safety. The incident has highlighted the need for increased investment in infrastructure maintenance and renewal, particularly in older urban areas. The government has promised a thorough investigation into the cause of the sinkhole and has pledged to take steps to prevent similar tragedies from occurring in the future. Section 6. A city on edge second sinkhole emerges, amplifying safety fears. Just when it seemed like the situation couldn't get any worse, a second sinkhole emerged just meters away from the first. This new development sent shockwaves through the community, amplifying fears about the safety of the city's infrastructure. The second sinkhole, though smaller than the first, was a stark reminder that the ground beneath Kuala Lumpur was unstable and potentially dangerous. The appearance of the second sinkhole raised questions about whether the rescue operation itself may have contributed to further ground instability. The heavy machinery used to remove debris and the constant vibrations from the search efforts could have weakened the surrounding soil, making it more susceptible to collapse. 
This possibility has fueled calls for a more cautious approach to future rescue operations in areas with similar geological conditions. Section 7. Unraveling the Cause Experts Investigate Infrastructure Integrity In the wake of the tragedy, experts have been brought in to investigate the cause of the sinkhole and to assess the overall integrity of the city's infrastructure. Geologists, engineers, and other specialists are examining the soil composition, the age and condition of the underground pipes, and the potential impact of recent construction projects in the area. Their findings will be crucial in determining what went wrong and what steps need to be taken to prevent similar incidents from occurring in the future. Preliminary investigations suggest that the sinkhole may have been caused by a combination of factors, including aging infrastructure, heavy rainfall, and ongoing construction in the area. Kuala Lumpur, like many rapidly growing cities in Southeast Asia, has struggled to keep pace with the demands placed on its infrastructure. Years of underinvestment in maintenance and renewal have left the city vulnerable to such disasters. Section 8. Vijaya Lakshmi Gali, a life cut short, dreams left unfulfilled. Vijaya Lakshmi Gali, the woman who vanished into the sinkhole, was more than just a name in the headlines. She was a wife, a mother, a daughter, a sister, a friend. She had dreams, aspirations, and a life that was tragically cut short. Gali, a native of Hyderabad, India, had traveled to Malaysia with her husband and friends on a long-awaited vacation. They had planned to spend two months exploring the country, experiencing its culture, and creating memories that would last a lifetime. Gali was known for her warm smile, her infectious laugh, and her kind and compassionate nature. She was a devoted wife and mother, and her family meant the world to her. She was also a devout Hindu, and had been looking forward to visiting the Batu Caves, a popular religious site located just outside of Kuala Lumpur. Tragically, she never got the chance. Section 9. Echoes of the Past Malaysia's Struggle with Sinkhole Disasters The tragic incident involving Vijaya Lakshmi Gali is not an isolated one. Malaysia, particularly its urban areas, has a history of sinkhole incidents, some of which have resulted in loss of life. These incidents serve as grim reminders of the dangers posed by aging and inadequate infrastructure. In recent years, sinkholes have appeared in various parts of Kuala Lumpur and other major cities, swallowing cars, damaging buildings, and disrupting traffic. While the causes of sinkholes can vary, they are often linked to leaking underground pipes, poor drainage systems, and construction activities that disturb the soil structure. Rapid urbanization, coupled with inadequate investment in infrastructure maintenance and renewal, has exacerbated the problem. The frequency of these incidents has raised concerns about the safety of residents and the need for stricter regulations and enforcement to ensure the integrity of infrastructure projects. Section 10. A Call for Action – Preventing Future Tragedies Through Vigilance The tragic disappearance of Vijaya Lakshmi Gali serves as a wake-up call for Malaysia and other rapidly developing nations. It highlights the urgent need to prioritize infrastructure safety and to invest in sustainable solutions that can withstand the pressures of urbanization and climate change. Preventing future tragedies requires a multi-pronged approach that includes increased investment in infrastructure maintenance and renewal. Aging pipes, sewers, and other underground infrastructure need to be regularly inspected, maintained, and replaced to prevent leaks and collapses. Improved urban planning and development. Sustainable urban planning that takes into account the carrying capacity of the land and the potential impact of construction on the environment is crucial. Stricter regulations and enforcement. Building codes and regulations need to be updated and strictly enforced to ensure the quality and safety of infrastructure projects. Public awareness and education. Citizens need to be educated about the risks of sinkholes and other infrastructure-related hazards and how to report potential problems to the authorities. Section 11. Lingering Questions, Enduring Hope, A Nation Awaits Answers As the search for Vijaya Lakshmi Gali has been officially called off, many questions remain unanswered. What exactly caused the sinkhole to collapse? Could the tragedy have been prevented? And what will become of the site where Gali vanished? The answers to these questions are crucial not only for bringing closure to Gali's grieving family, but also for preventing similar tragedies from occurring in the future. While the official search may be over, the hope of finding Gali, against all odds, endures. 
Her family clings to the belief that she may still be alive, perhaps trapped in an air pocket or clinging to debris. They have vowed to continue their own search, refusing to give up hope until they have exhausted every possibility. Their unwavering determination is a testament to the power of love and the enduring strength of the human spirit in the face of unimaginable loss.